everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to talk about some new shots from the Little Mermaid TV spot. The first new shot is of Ariel swimming through the sea. I feel that this sequence takes place in her protected territory, the high sun side of Carini. I also think it takes place at the beginning of the film as Ariel has her bag with her that she puts her dingle hopper in. The second new shot features Ariel swimming towards the surface and her reflection. This seems symbolic of how Ariel is swimming towards her true self who is a human above the surface. Also her hair looks especially pretty in this shot. The third shot features most of Ariel's sisters and they look incredible in their live action form. Their identities are Marla, Indira, Perla, Tamika and Caspia. Sadly we don't get to see Karina but we have got glimpses of her in her cartoon form. Additionally this setting appears to be a throne room. There is a high large throne for King Triton and seven smaller thrones for each of the sisters. The fourth new shot features Ariel playing with a yellow puffer fish and Hallie is giving off serious princess vibes. I presume this is from the under the sea sequence during the line and oh that blowfish blow. The fifth new shot is my favourite one and it features Ariel falling off a squid into a sea of pink jellyfish. I love her hair movement in this sequence as well as her purple and green crop top. Again I presume this is from under the sea. The sixth shot is of Ariel and Prince Eric during Kiss the Girl and I can definitely feel the chemistry between them. Ariel is wearing the pale blue dress that we have previously seen on merchandise and a really cute pink headband. Eric looks very similar to his animated counterpart as he is wearing a white shirt and a blue vest which are his signature colours in the original film. Also in the background you can see green vines with lights on them just like in the animated film. The final shot is a tease of Ursula who is of course purple. She has on thick eyeshadow and her tentacles are moving in front of her face. Also in the background you can see her tentacles are glowing blue which looks really cool. From what I heard in the leaked trailer Melissa McCarthy has a completely different voice to how she usually speaks. It sounded really good and I think she is going to do a great job. Overall I really liked this trailer and I don't understand why people didn't like the CGI because I think it looked great. Anyway that is all for today. Like this video if you liked it and please subscribe. It would mean so much to me. Bye now and have a magical day.